Dr. Abhradit Das, Consultant Pulmonologist, Narayana Multispecialty Hospital, Jashorot, Kolkata. Today we are going to discuss regarding some airborne diseases. One is we are facing the COVID-19 and it is fading nowadays. But another deadly virus is H1N1 infection is spreading everywhere and it is causing harm to our society. How we can find it, how we can diagnose it, how we can treat it and obviously we need to know how we can prevent it. First thing the symptom cough and cold along with fevers is the initial symptom some may have some headache and sore throat if the symptom increases like that shortness of breath drowsiness some loose motions or some convulsion decrease in blood pressure you need to bring the patient to some health care facility for diagnosis we need to do some artificial test by some nasopharyngeal and oropharyngeal swab next part is the treatment part in initial cases, if the symptom is mild, we need to do, go for some symptomatic treatment only. When we are bringing the patient to hospitals, we have to treat it some antiviral therapy and send the test for send the test and do not wait for the result. Along with that thing, we need to do some oxygen support. In case of severe cases, we may need some ventilatory support also. Next part is the contact tracing. Those who are having contact with these patients need to get some antiviral therapy also. Those are in high risk group like extremes of age, having sugar pressure, immunocompromised state, oral steroids or pregnant women. Obviously, these are to be done along with some advice by some physicians. Next part is the prevention is one of the important part. If we can prevent this influenza inf infection by regular uh, vaccinations yearly in the first batch of vaccination should be given either when the quadrivalent vaccine is available in the uh, September month yearly by this time by this thing we can do some better and can control these infections thank you